I'm Storm Team 5 meteorologist Dave Miller. This is the WeAreGreenBay.com weather update. We're Temperatures were a little bit cooler than what we saw on Friday, mostly in the low 40s, some mid 40s in the southern sections. But otherwise, we had rain showers, light rain across the area, but we have a second system that's going to be moving just to the south of us. And that's going to be spreading some heavy snow across some sections of southeast Wisconsin and also across northern Illinois. If you plan on uh, heading down that direction in the next 24 hours, you might want to reconsider or make some alternate plans because we could be looking at some really heavy weather down this direction. So anywhere south of Milwaukee, south of Madison, especially now, these locations north of this warning area could still see some snow, maybe two, three inches, depending upon where you are. Uh, some of these locations down here could see maybe as much as a foot. And we could be looking in Illinois at a combination of maybe some sleet turning to uh, some light snow or rather heavier snow as we head in towards the afternoon. So this starts as far as southeast Wisconsin's concerned about 9 a.m. on Sunday and will continue until early Monday morning. And there are blizzard warnings out for southern Iowa and northern Missouri and also across the Plain State. So this is also going to produce a lot of wind, which is going to cause a lot of blowing and drifting. So again, uh, travel down that direction probably isn't advised as we head through the day on Sunday. Now you can see rain showers and even uh, a few flurries and a couple of snow showers up around the upper peninsula, parts of uh, northern Wisconsin as of uh, the early evening hours. This continues to move off to the east. So first system is bringing in some slightly cooler air, uh, more seasonal temperatures. This is the system that's going to move through and this is going to intensify as it continues to drift to the east. So it will really start to power up as it heads into Illinois and Indiana. And that's where we expect some of the heavier snow just north of there across parts of Iowa, northern Illinois, southern Wisconsin, while areas to the north around northeast Wisconsin probably won't see too much with the exception maybe the southeastern corner. So we start out with temperatures around 30 on Sunday morning. We'll hit mid 30s probably early in the day and then drop off. Then we're looking for some pretty cold temperatures along with some breezy conditions. So we'll look for some rather cold wind chill factors Monday and Tuesday. And then we kind of moderate a little bit as we head in towards the end of the week. The amounts of snow, as I mentioned, Really nothing across a good portion of northeast Wisconsin could see maybe an inch or two, say around Sheboygan and areas to the south, and then that, that number is going to really increase quite a bit the further south you go. So our forecast for Saturday night, mostly cloudy skies, temperatures around 30. Then as we look ahead to the next couple of days, we'll see again uh, some snow or snow showers down to the south, mid-30s for highs. The rest of us are going to be looking at overcast skies. Turns a lot colder then for Monday and Tuesday. We'll see some sun out there cold, but also some rather cold wind chill factors as well.